As a single guy, I've done my fair share of dating. But today, the tables are turning. As the Hebrews say, I'm going to be a yenta or a matchmaker. <laughs> Looking for love in all the wrong okay. places. Okay. This has nothing to do with matchmaking. Looking. Sure. Yes, I'm going to be a modern day yenta as I join Elisa from Three Day Rule to see if I've got what it takes to give Cupid a run for his money. You're in the lovemaking business now. I've, well, I've been in the lovemaking <laughs> oh, business no. for a while. I'm here to become a matchmaker today. Alrighty. So can you give me an idea of what that entails? The process of matchmaking really comes down to accumulating options, find out the person's type, and then from there you're gonna kind of whittle them down. So you guys are like dating real estate agents. Correct. So the first step to being a matchmaker is to meet who you're gonna match. And my client is none other than Landon Clements, star of Bravo's Southern Charm. I've loved you for a long time. You have? Yeah. I didn't know. I've never like been with a matchmaker. I've never done any online dating. First time for everything. So what kind of guy are you looking for? I'm really athletic. I grew up playing a lot of sports. I love to ski and surf and the outdoors. I want someone who's like well-traveled and sort of otherworldly. From physical attributes and appearance, what's your type? Well, I'm pretty tall, so I do like someone who's tall as well. I'm not quite sure what I think of Johnny's a matchmaker yet, but he definitely made the experience fun. I think we built I a pretty solid profile. It. All right, guys, good luck. Next, I need to find potential matches for Landon, and where better than the streets of LA? Do you have any tips on how I should approach strangers? Anybody that's walking super quickly or that has earbuds in is on a telephone call, definitely do not stop them. Here's perfect, sir. Sir, do we have a proposition for you? Wait, 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 wait. You can even compliment guys, too. You have piercing eyes. Well, maybe not quite that. Then they're definitely going to feel like you're, you're picking them up. How about this guy? How about this guy? How about this guy? Yeah. Sure. Well, let me tell you guys. I have a proposition for you. I'm a professional matchmaker. We have this girl. Her name is Landon. And we are trying to set her up with a bachelor. I am single. Oh, my god. You're so cute. Are you single? Yeah. How do you feel about uh, athletic stuff? Oh, yeah, I like that. Definitely. Right. How old are you? 19. Perfect. Perfect. I think that's a hair, yeah. <laughs> All right, no, 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 Is that real? It's real, oh yeah. Well, that is real. Dude. That is a beard, that's a beard. You wanna grab his number and grab his email and then, and then follow from later. Now, is it gonna be weird if I ask no, a guy for his all. number? No, already told him what it's for. So, can I get your digits, man, or what? Just in case, <laughs> I need to like hit you up. How about this guy? Perfect. He's perfect. What's your name? Rupert. I'm Johnny. Are you single? I am. I can see it already. <laughs> Save the date. Oh my Rupert gosh. and Landon. Oh my lord. Now that we have, I think, a pool yes. to choose from, yeah. I'm going on dates You're with these guys. You're going on dates with these guys, so she doesn't have to. They better be picking up you the bill. You ain't seen nothing yet. And I've whittled it down to two potentials. It's Rupert versus Alex. Time to woo me, fellas. What are your interests? What are you into? Being outdoors. You like traveling? Yeah, I travel a lot. So you basically want someone who's going to be the yin to your yang. Absolutely. I think it's time that I, I find someone to uh, settle down with. She said no muscles, though. That could be a problem. I mean... I'd say you're a pretty confident guy, right? I'd like to think so. Is she athletic? Does that look like an athletic specimen to you, or what? Yeah. Oh. It's a tough decision, but I can only choose one date for Landon. Well, there's my little southern belle. Mr. Bananas. <laughs> How are you? A little nervous. You're about to meet a guy that you've never met before <laughs> that I've set you up with. <laughs> On a scale of one to Johnny Bananas, and yeah. Johnny Bananas being like the perfect package, <laughs> he's a perfect seven. I'm gonna be sitting right out there in that windowless van watching your date, okay? So creepy. I believe in you. Well, here, here goes nothing. We got it. And the match I've chosen for Landon is... Hello. How are you doing? How are you doing? <laughs> so nice to meet you. You too. I'm Landon. Great <laughs> fair. Good greeting. Yep. He seems very comfortable. I've never done this before, so I'm just curious how it went on your end. I mean, did you meet with Johnny? I did. Yeah, yeah well, like, in the end, we started having a bit of a bromance. <laughs> She's laughing. Yeah, she is. She's Listen, been giggling a lot. You know what they say, you make a girl laugh. You keep them forever. Do you have children? I don't have any kids. You don't have any no. kids? No, I mean, I've got Have you uh, been married before? No, we've been no. married before. Does it bother you that I've been married before? Not at all. You had a boy, Rupert. What's the longest relationship you've ever had? Four years. That's a, that's a legitimate amount of time. I travel a lot, so I, I spend a lot of time kind of in 
in Asia. I was in Thailand for a bit. Now we're in the so travel. You're done yep. for this. I've never uh, been there. I really want to go. Do you mind if I borrow your knife to cut this in half? I really do. I see it. Of course you can, yeah. I it. think he's so smitten. You look great. Thank you. You really do. Thank you very much. You as well. <laughs> Are they in a bar or a petting zoo right now? Because uh, with all the touching going on. I think I'm so blushing. Right. Yes. <laughs> You're like the most charming southern girl I've ever met. How many so, have you met? One. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. It was really good. Yo. Yo. I think we did it. Crushed it. I think it's time to get out there so they can actually hear from the horse's mouth. There they are. Hi. So, how was I like that? to think it went okay. It went okay. <laughs> Honey, I think this could be a career path I think for it could you. Be. Is there going to be a second date? Would you like to go on a second date? <laughs> yes. Yeah. There we go. Second date then. All right, you two, go have fun. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> so I gotta say, I've given you matchmaker status officially. Already. Already. So what you're saying is I basically can go play a fiddle on top of a roof. I think it would be a crime not to. You are now my rose. It's essentially a masterpiece.